Assalamualaikum viewers. Constructive criticism is an art and a skill that we must all learn. We can make others benefit tremendously if we use this tool in a wise manner. Now there are five essentials of constructive criticism that I'd like to point out. The first essential of constructive criticism is that we must start off each criticism by acknowledging the qualities and good points of the person whom we intend to criticize because this will create confidence and engender trust between the two and will make that person realize that we are his or her well-wishers. The second essential of constructive criticism is that we must directly communicate the criticism to that person because if we do not do so, then more often than not in closed circles, our critique will reach that person indirectly and this will cause a lot of ill feeling and bad taste. The third essential of constructive criticism is that we must use soft words in communicating our critique. The most profound criticism will lose its impact if it is couched in harsh and stern words. Now the fourth essential of constructive criticism is that we must try not to communicate this criticism for a mistake right at the time a person is committing that mistake because he or she will not be left with sufficient time to contemplate on what we like her or him to do. And the fifth and final essential of constructive criticism is that uh, we must not be repetitive in our criticism. We must give the other person the time to contemplate and to realize uh, what we try, what we intend to co com communicate to him. So these are the five essentials of constructive criticism that I think we must all adopt as a tool in our lives. Thank you.